Hi, I'm Dr. Joni Liu, and welcome back to Cosmic Tidbits and to part two of Why You're Stronger Than You Think. So the collective ego wants you to believe that you're helpless. It wants you to believe that you can depend on it and its institutions to help you. But I'm pretty sure that you've had the experience that they're not much help at all. And if there is help, it's pretty inconsistent. I mean, any of you ever go to school, you know, as a kid? Yeah, I'm sure most of you have been in school. And so you know what it's like. I mean, it's interesting because an off-the-cuff, careless uh, comment can weaken you. I mean, for me, it happened when I was in grade seven. And what I was doing, what was happening was a drawing and coloring contest that my grade two teacher had come up with. So she thought it would be a great idea to get everybody um, participating. So we were all given uh, a piece of paper with a drawing on it and we were all going to color inside the lines and whoever did it perfectly got to be number one and the prize. Okay, so I actually won that very first contest. So it was really great. Okay, so I think a week later, there was another uh, coloring contest. And, and I won again, or I thought I did, because my picture again was colored within the lines. Okay, so colored within the lines. She looked at my drawing, looked at my coloring, and she said, Oh, well, you can't win a second week in a row. So she gave it to the second place kid. Well, I thought, well, that's not right. That's not right. And I think that's what started me on the road to mistrusting authority. <laughs> mistrusting authority. So, no, we're not helpless, but we can definitely be wronged. So I'll be back tomorrow with another Cosmic Tidbit on why you are stronger than you think, part three. Bye.